Hi children, in today's class, we are going to discuss about animals. Animals, big and small, tiny animals, they all live all over the world. There are different kinds. We have wild and domestic animals. When you look at our surroundings, what do we see? We see all kinds of animals. Large and small and tiny. Similarly, there are animals all over the world. So let us look at types of animals. Types of animals. Animals are seen all over. Now we are going to look at Types of animals that we see in and around the place. Okay. The first type is wild. The first type is wild animals. Now when we say wild animals, they normally live in the jungle. That's why they are called wild. The whole place in the jungle, they can use it freely. They wander freely. They move about freely from place to place, killing any animal they like to eat and they go on. Now, some of these wild animals are ferocious, very dangerous. And some of these dangerous wild animals, you and I would like to see. So we see some of them in the zoo. These dangerous animals are caged in the zoo, taking away their freedom. Now, dangerous animals, they cannot live with us because they might kill us. Now, the day, the Wild animals, examples of few wild animals are tiger, lion, hawk, bear and so on. So few wild animals are tiger, all tigers, lion, bear, and fox. These are just few. So what are wild animals? Animals that live in the jungle. They are dangerous, ferocious. They move from place to place freely. They kill tiny animals for food. Those are the wild type. Now, domestic. The second category is domestic animals. That is number two, domestic. Domestic animals. Now, what are these domestic animals? Domestic animals, you have seen them right around our house. They are small and big. They live in your home, in your garden. You see them at the park and we call them like goat, buffaloes, cows, animals that live with us in our garden, in and around the house. We call them domestic and the examples of them are some of them, goat, cow, and so on. Buffaloes, they are all, they are all harmless. You, they will eat some grass, they do not harm you. They are so nice, so you take care of them. Now, when you talk about domestic animals, there are two types. Uh, domestic, domestic animals are of two kinds or two types. One, one is 
the farm animal one is the farm the other pet so in the domestic we have two types a farm animals animals that are kept in the farm the farmer needs them to plough the land or a man has a farm you will have all kinds of goats and cows and horses and ducks all animals there animals kept in the farm for the purpose of helping the farmer or for food eggs and milk and things like that now so animals that kept in the farm are called farm animals examples of farm animals are horses cows goats and sheep horses cows goats sheep all that b we are talking about now these animals they are in large numbers sometimes they give us useful things like cows and buffaloes and goats give us milk they give us wool hen and dog give us eggs and meat horses are used for riding so the farm animals give us lots of useful things for us now when we talk about pet second category pet animals animals that you love to have them around you pet animals are kept at home as your pets like the cat and the dog and some more there is okay examples are cats dogs birds fish etc okay so types of animals wild animals a dangerous ferocious animal domestic animals live in and around our home harmless very sweet gentle tame ones but the domestic animals are of two category one large number of animals that live in group in the farm to help the farmer for milk meat egg etc there are pet animal that you grow to take care that they they love you they guard the house and you like to have some good feeling looking after a pet